Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube video and on it today we are going to be joined by my friends Anthony, Melina, and Isabella. We are doing our history project on chapter 8 lesson 1 through 3. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for all my videos. And we can't have any comments be telling us it was good. Tell us how it was good, and if it was bad, tell us how it was bad, and maybe where we messed up. At so at the future we can fix it. <laughs> Daniel Boone and 30 woodsmen cut a road to over the Appalachian Mountains into Kentucky. After about 250 miles, they arrived in the meadows along the banks of Kentucky, the Kentucky River. Felix Walker and a member of the woods, the 30 woodsmen wrote this. Okay. The Continental Congress's plan. The Continental Congress began to develop a plan for a national government, and when they decided that the government has to be republic. The Continental Congress passed the Article of Confederation around the United States. Eight states ratified the Confederation, but some of the smaller states that didn't have land claims refused to sign it. Mutiny in the Confederation army. When the value of continental currency sank to a new low, Congress had problems supplying the American army. Great shortages of food led to a short-lived mutiny among some continent connect Connecticut soldiers at Washington camp in New Jersey. Maryland became the 13th state to sign the article as a result in the last signing the United States finally had a official government. Okay. In 1783, a court decision ruled the Massachusetts 1780 Constitution effectively outlawed slavery by declaring that all men are born free and equal. Land ordinance. Congress arranged for surveys to divide the Western territories into townships with only lot in each town set aside as a site for a public school. When it, the a delegates of the army officials complained to Congress about their unpaid salaries and pensions. Congress had no quick solution. An anonymous letter urged officers to unite and attempt one last appeal to Congress. Okay, about hundred thousand Americans lived in Kentucky. By 1790s, also new state government were formed. 
And here's where we got our music. Hello, this is Anthony with Chapter 8, Lesson 2. A constitutional convention is called a making changes require amending the articles of competition because the national government had been granted no power. The great compress was an argument. The New Jersey plan called, called for a legislature, but they had only one house and each state would have one vote. The New Jersey plan was similar to the Articles of Confederation. The delegates voted on these two plans on June 19th. Each state would have an equal number of votes. Regulating trade. Aside from dealing any can on the slave trade, the Constitution placed few limits of Congress power to regulate commerce. The Constitution also gave Congress sole power to coin money. This now, why it matters now, the Constitution Convention formed the plan of government that the United States still has today. Now, some more facts about all of it. The keywords that we were dealing with in this that the I was dealing with in this lesson was Constitution Convention, the fifty five delegates that were known as the Philippine Meeting. And I, James Madison was one of the ablest delegates. Virgin plan, a plan proposed by Edmund Waddoff. New Jersey plan, a plan of government proposed at the Constitutional Convention in 1787. Great conquest, the Constitutional Convention Agreement to establish a two house national leg legislature. Three fifth com complex. The Constitutional Convention Agreement to count three fifths of a state's slaves as population for purposes of variation and taxation. Now, some more facts. Now, delegates from throughout the states who are coming to the Philippines to discuss reforming the government. In September of the year 1786, delegates from the five states met up in Annapur Milan to discuss why to promote trade among their states. The delegates assembled the conversation begins. Most of the delegates arrived at the Constitutional Convention without a clear idea of what to expect. On May 29th, the delegates begin the real work of the de de design a new national government. In response to the Vigum Plan, New Jersey Delegates Willem Carlton presented an elaborate on June 15th. The southern state had many more slaves than the northern state. Most of the delegates were glad that Congress would relate and even promote. And that's the end of my talk. Hi guys, it's Walida here with Lesson 3.
By the time yeah. that the Constitution yeah. opened, Americans had been debating a new constitution for months. The documents had been printed in newspapers and handed out in pamphlets across the United States. The farmers suspected that people might be afraid the Constitution would take too much power away from the states. Federalism is a system of government and power which is shared between the central government and the state, linking themselves the idea of federalism. The people who supported the Constitution took the name Federalist. Delaware, New Jersey, and Pennsylvania voted for ratification in January 1788. Georgia and Connecticut ratified the Constitution. George Mason, perhaps the most influential Virginia, aside from Washington, also was opposed to it. Mason has been a delegate to the Constitutional Convention in Philadelphia, but he had refused to sign the final document. Now I'm going to hand over the computer to Isabella. Hi, this is Isabella with Chapter 3, Lesson 3. And okay, so, so the Feathers Papers. Okay. Federalists wrote essays to answer the anti federalist attacks. The best known Federalist essays are the Federalist Papers. The three politicians. Poli who wrote the Federalist Papers were James Madison, Alexander Hamilton, and John Jay. The Bill of Rights. People who supported the Bill of Rights hoped that it would set forth to the rights of all Americans. People believed that it was needed to protect people against the power of government. Americans across the nation debated whether the conditions would produce the best government. In 1787, in Hartford, Connecticut, 168 delegates met to decide whether their state should ratify the U.S. Con Constitution. The first four states convention to ratify the Constitution were held in December 1787. Federalism is a system of government in which power is shared between the government and the states. Linking themselves to the idea of federalism, the people who supported the con Constitution took the name Federalists. People who opposed the con 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 Constitution were called anti federalists. They wrote essays to answer the anti federalist attacks. And that was. All of the rest of our video. Hope you like it and don't forget to subscribe and put good comments.